or pipeline. It's a plan very much in the works. Kinder Morgan Energy Partners are currently exploring the demand for a new pipeline that would span six states from Louisiana to Florida. WYFF News 4's Allie Miles joins us live in the studio to explain the Palmetto Project. Allie? Yeah, Carol Michael, right now there is a pipeline that already goes from here to here in South Carolina. Now, the proposed Palmetto Project would go from here in Belton all the way down to North Augusta and then continuing to Jacksonville, Florida. Take a drive to or through Belton, you're going to see this sign, and you're also going to see tankers carrying fuel. It, if you can take the, the, the product off the highway and put it on the ground, then naturally that's going to be a, a, a vital safety concern for us. The Palmetto project is still in the very, very early stages. According to Kinder Morgan, the company has only talked to potential shippers so far to feel out the level of interest. The goal? Create a $1 billion pipeline that moves gas, ethanol, and diesel from the Gulf Coast to new markets in the Southeast. In a statement, one of Kinder Morgan's reps told us, in part, while a general route has been developed and includes approximately 100 miles of pipeline through South Carolina, it is very preliminary and subject to change. Belton's interim city administrator likes the idea of the Palmetto project for business reasons. Uh, it probably would bring some impact of some jobs to, to our area and having local businesses in town that would have restaurants or overnight stays or, or even you know, selling gasoline to soft drinks would, would definitely help the impact of the air. Even though the tankers drive through Belton, the gas farm is technically on Anderson County territory. We've always been good stewards and good uh, citizens, corporate citizens in the community and um, they've always been very helpful with us when we need anything. The county's economic development director thinks the Palmetto project could work out well for the Palmetto state. It is always a good thing to have lots of infrastructure, and I think it'll be a good thing for Anderson County. Now, like we said, this is still in the very early stages. Potential shippers have until the 30th to commit to the project. Then they'll evaluate if there's enough interest in this to go forward. If it does go through, it's projected for July of 2017. Allie Miles, WIFF News 4, live in the studio. Carol, Michael.